Hey guys, it's your Poker Bears, and welcome back to my Olympic Marseille career mode. FIFA 16 Olympic Marseille career mode, I should say. Hey, we're the last month. Half off. Half I completed it the first half of the season. Hmm. And yes, we are officially halfway through the season and in to the January transfer window. Oh. No signings have been fully completed as of yet. I have sent a few contracts. The player's way, I've gotten a few offers accepted, and there's one player who may be on his way. <clears throat> and if you've seen the last two episodes, you'll know why I'm I'm a bit tempted to sell this player. And that player is Stephen Fletcher. I have waiting for me. I think it's seven offers for for Fletcher. Seven. Seven offers. I mean, and if I can get a decent price for Stephen Fletcher, I know I shouldn't really be able to sell Fletcher because apparently he's on loan at, from Sunderland instead of having been bought by Marseille. But uh, this game likes to mess things up because it has Tovan down as a official Marseille player as well instead of being on loan for the season from Newcastle but don't worry I'm not gonna sell Tovan I wasn't gonna sell Tovan anyway he's actually been playing very well but Stephen Fletcher I I'm actually really considering it because the last two Two episodes have not really, he's not really shown me his best form. As you see, I'm also, in the, in the uh, first game of this episode, I am playing the team that are rock bottom of the, of the, uh, I almost said the Premier League there. Uh, well, the French Premier League, I guess you could call it. Like, uh, it's, well, the French equivalent of the Premier League. Our game today is Marseille, and they play so in a way, Chelsea. yes, I was all, I was half correct. Marseille's lineup: Steve Mandanda starts in goal. Florian Tovan starts, a midfielder in good form. In attack, Stephen Fletcher starts. He was man of the match last time. Out. In any case, um, I don't know. I, I I could be about to suck. I um challenge between the two of them there. Ben Yedda and well, the ball deserved, perhaps I, I was hoping that Ben Yedda would be signed before this match so I could uh, try him out and see if see if he will play better than Steam Fletcher I mean Fletcher hasn't played bad but the last few games he's just made a few mistakes and just they've lost the ball possibly cost some really easy Weak challenge. They put that cross far too close to the goalkeeper. Olsen, you know, it, it's a bit worrying that one of my he main strikers is pretty much doing everything he can to not Shots score, seemingly. No I mean, I hope he's not, I, I assume he's not doing that on purpose, team. but he's, his performances the have taken, you know, a dip. His performances aren't as good as they were. A few episodes ago. To hit this, and he's done it. And that has opened the scoring. 1 0 here. From the goalkeeper, given catching practice from long range, really. And um, that's all I'm going to say on that topic because it's that's cost me a goal. Well, I need to focus here. Players done well here until it was the direction of the pass, really. Right, it's only the second goal I can see in the league, and it's to the team that's bottom of the fucking league. And in goes the cross. He can lay it off to the supporting player. And a real. Oh yes, there we go. He scores his third goal. Oh yeah, Marcy. He sure it won't let me get the ball. Get the ball. Oh dumbass. So away we go at one all. 
Here we go. They were only ahead for eight minutes. Which is eight minutes too long, if you ask me. The goalkeeper with a textbook save. Who, who was that? Fletcher again! He completely ignored the ball. He left it go past him. If he had taken that, he might have if led to a goal. Oh, see, this is why I'm considering in taking an offer for you, Stephen. Hmm. Hmm. Mate, you better hope Obenera comes in and has the worst game any player could have. The yeah, I figure Tovan was offside, but Fletcher wasn't. Timing. I know that for a fact. He left the ball for no particular reason. Chen Loglu went in doubt. Call upon your, your top goal scorer, and he will sort you out. I did not mean to rhyme there, but I did. And there we go, the balance of power, as it were, has been restored. A bit in and out, Marseille, in what we've seen so far, but in the lead they are, and certainly not out of the picture as far as the match is concerned. I have to teach these little shits a lesson. With this goal advantage, they've now got a corner. I mean, they're bottom of the league, they shouldn't even be a challenge. And yet they got their s the second goal I've ever considered against me. Hmm. Nah. I ain't taking that lightly. Offside called, and we can see again now. Oh, that's a good call. Yeah, I think it was. Someone must have been offside. One because there was a couple of yards in it, I think. The referee's giving a free kick instead of the uh, corner. Well, there's a quick throw on here to get them. I'm going to go in at halftime, two-one up. I would much rather for two-nil, but. This is half time, that's the whistle, and 2 1 is the score at this stage. What can you do? Activity on the bench for the losing team, a substitute getting ready to come on. And in a way, it was a Steve Fletcher that uh, cost me that goal. Super header. If I wasn't sat there talking. In the spot there. In about him, I would have been able to prevent that goal. Why my defenders didn't do their job is another topic altogether, but still. Yeah, don't header it the other way. Header it out for a corner. Why not? Easy take for Steeman then. Come on, Fletch. Uh, it's all you. If he gets there before the keeper, he didn't get there before the keeper. And they're playing like league leaders. And he's offside. Brilliant. You couldn't get back fast enough, could you? Imagine if I had shot towards goal, or oh, it gone in, and the uh, game considered that. As an attempt to pass. The break is definitely on. It would have been given offside. Off hey, Fletcher actually did something right for one. Once in three he episodes. That is a sensation. It still doesn't hit first time top right. Really. Three one the score line as we the game. He, he make me want to uh, not consider it. I'm still going to consider those offers. And coming up for you. See the problem the with a uh, 28 year old striker as he is. This he being Steve Fletcher. The problem is you don't 
know what value you can place on him without scaring teams off. Hang on. Maybe Fletcher can redeem himself from earlier. Straight at the goalkeeper. Straight at the goalkeeper. Once again. Seriously, Fletcher? Are you freaking G? Irking me off here? Are you fucking kidding me? Headed towards where a teammate can gather the ball. He's missed it. I mean, just don't know what to do with him. Enough coming for you on EA Sports. The logical choice is to action for the away side. It's their next game, incidentally. Value him and see he he if one of the and I'm dead serious. There are seven offers for you, Stephen. Seven. One of those teams will probably pay if I ask. The question is, how much can I get for you? It's an own goal. I think that's an own goal. Yeah, it is. Does that and not go straight? In, yeah, very clearly off the, the head of the opposition's number 15. Mangan makes it 4-1. Bad enough to be behind now, but to do it with an own goal is particularly annoying for the team and the player in question. Let's see what the ref's going to do. So, yeah. That's a uh, three points wrapped up. Van de Veel. He can lay it off to the supporting player. Question is, how much will I value Stephen tackle. Fletcher at? Because as is, Sharply done. I would it here. not be sad to see the back oh, of Stephen Fletcher. Well, he took no chances there. It's a corner. And it's in by the post. As is made. He did 5 1 by Nkalu. Goal See that tall man, he was running to celebrate in the end like, ah, fuck it. <laughs> what the hell was that? He half wanted to celebrate, half said fuck it. Nothing so far in this game to surprise us. Perhaps only the, the margin that they lead by. Yeah, it's not always easy coming into a game and everyone's expecting you to get a hat full, but they've... It's a quick break. Can Fletcher score again? Yes, he can. Well, I say again, and I mean in the season. In the game, they've got another one. Extended the lead. And Bashawai kind of returns the favour for earlier. Fair play to them. Well, here's the goal again. Well, he's point blank range, but you've got to be there to score. You've got to be there. To and if anything, that adds a bit more to his value, doesn't it? Another goal. <laughs> I'll just over 6 1, which I'm pretty sure is the worst defeat I've inflicted so far in this career mode. Very good game to watch, and Marseille have played the leading part in it, really. Maybe the stars. I could be wrong. I think 4 1 might be. Was my previous best against. Montpellier when they. When I can see in my first goal. The official has indicated three more minutes. Yuga. I'll have to see. I'll look at the uh, overall see. He's in stats and see if this has been put down as my best victory. It definitely will if I get seventh. Tovan! Nope, straight at the keeper. It didn't matter anyway. 6 1. And a very comfortable victor. He. He, despite the early, he set back. Liga Earn. Hopefully, get some good news. GFC Ajaxio 1. Updates? No. See? There's there's the offers. Look at 
Six. I was almost right. Maybe someone pulled out. I could have sworn there were seven. Maybe that was another offer I was looking at. In third, Let's look at the teams here. We have in fourth, have Hanover, West Brom, Bordeaux. Well, we're gonna reject them anyway because. If I'm going to sell Fletcher, I'm not going to sell him to a league rival. Real Sociedad, Aston Villa, and Schalke. So we have five teams we could sell him to. We've two German teams, two English teams, and a Spanish team. The game says 8.5 is his valuation. bottom, Angers with 17 points, but only behind... On goal 11 and a half? To lose with 11 and a half, 12? Let, let's let's try 12, and if they can't make 12, I'll go and lower it to 11 and a half. The uh, the chaos commence. See who wants him more, as it were. Five teams. I've told them my my price. Now we'll see if they can meet it. Also, if you missed yesterday's episode, you with missed PSG dropping some points. They lost to Cien, and the team that drew against them was Leon. Hmm. Ironic, isn't it? Look at that. I didn't play Leon. Who will I play after them? Cien! <laughs> this game sometimes, yo. It was just crazy. Oh, we have something. An offer for Bashawai. Nope. It's not Chelsea. So it's a no. As much as I'd love to, who he did not go to Liverpool, so no. He didn't go to Monaco either. Nope. Nope, that's Wolfsburg, not Chelsea. Hanover have come back. They've come back 10, 10, 10 7.5, 9 and a half. I think Hanover and hmm, was it West Brom? Yeah, it was West Brom. I think they're gonna bite and meet the eleven and a half, but I don't think Real Sus. I think Real Sus that may pull out. You know, I'm gonna tell them I, I will take a five. I mean, they only they only offered an extra. 1.5 mil. I don't know about Villa. I don't know. Maybe maybe Villa will will give the extra 2 mil. We'll see. Bolster some of my second tier choices. I've signed Ballas on loan because I hear, heard that he's quite a prospect. Young prospect, and as you can see, I uh, put in a bid for Bentaleb, as it looks like Inter Milan are in for him as well. How much did I bid for him? I think I bid more than 5 mil. Did I? I am trying to remember now. This is like... Those are all the f extra deals. Oh, I did... I bid five mil, but he's uh, reviewing a contract, so hopefully he'll accept that before Inter Milan. I'm tentatively not gonna raise my offer. Tentatively, hopefully, this won't be a mistake. Four offers. Ch 
Schalke have come back with eight million. Brett wants a bigger role. Ben Yedder er, is done. Eighteen million, as you can see. And I uh, am signing a new young winger her to replace Sar. And he is actually in the deep. Oh, for my signing of Mike. Or, or, or is that I, I'm just going to call him Mike, okay? Just, just for the reference, I'm just going to call him Mike. Welcome, Mike. Keep that. For uh, what did I offer him? I think I offered him squad rotation, so important first team player. And I don't remember what I offered him in terms of wages, so I'm just going to offer him 80. Just to make him, make sure that he knows that I value him. Shaka, I will tell you why I told, told all the art teams. I will go no lower than 11.5. 8 million ain't going to do it. Ben Yedder onto the bench. And like I said, I want to give him a run out. Before I've decided what I'm going to do with Stephen Fletcher. Well, I think it's almost certain now that he is going to leave. But uh, the question is, where is he going to go? I wanted a proper left midfielder for this uh, second team. That's why I signed Mike here. He can play on the right and he can play in the center if need be. He's so a very versatile player. Her. His stats are... Well, they're, I mean, they're okay. Not the best, but I mean, 73 at 18 years old. 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 Should be pretty good. Good for this team. Eh, and for a reference, I will put Ben Yedder there. I'm going to move Fletcher up here until well, I find out where, what his, where his future lies. Whether I, where he is going to stay or whether he is going to move. Hey, yeah! Sign that go. Hunter. Bentaleb. Yeah, screw you. Who enter? Her. For I wanted to make sure I had a new option for the second team. There we go. Bentaleb is in. Move Ballas up here so that I remember to play him. And once his uh, rating has gone up a bit, I will be putting him into the uh, thing for a bit. I've gotten an offer for Mandanda. Nope. It's not who he went to. I will negotiate only with the team he went to in real life, which is. Crystal Palace. That's going to be my new thing. Wayne to sign Bentleb. As you see, I did try to get Cochrane, but uh, Arsenal wanted too much money for him, so Bentleb will uh, is a much is uh, just as good. Alger, the Alger, and 21 year old, 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 will do the job that I need, he, he's done. So, we're just waiting on Fletcher and Burnett. I'm looking for something. I think that was mine, yeah. See, I, uh, got a new 
who you player from one of my uh, scouting trips, an Austrian left winger. Is uh not exactly something to. He's not exactly an eye-catching sign. Uh, find, but. Can you expect? Fletcher wants to play. Nope. Ah, the two English teams have agreed. They will both be trying to acquire Mr. Fletcher for the 11.5 million in price. Unesi, nope. Liverpool, I so wish. Wish I could, but he didn't go to Liverpool, he went to Chelsea. And Monaco, no. Oh, Mikel. I thought that said Michael. I guess I could look at his name being spelled that way. What time are we looking? Oh, shit! 26 minutes? I don't have time to play this match. Um. Damn. Yo, transfers be, be killing this. This. Gig, yo! This is the same thing that happened in the Liverpool crew. What? Oh. I can't even get the second match in, and it's not like the ma if the match was a bit soon, or I could have done all this off camera. I mean, I could play this match, but it would go way too long, and this video would never be able to upload. PSG have won their match, so... I guess I will leave it here. Thanks for watching. hope you enjoyed it. Smash the like button if you did. Hit subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, let me know in the comment section below what you think of the new signs and what you th think about, about me agreeing to E. Fletcher back to England. I shouldn't be getting any money for him. I'm going back to England, if anything, I should be paying to cancel his loan for Sunderland if I was going to send him back to England, but that's just the case. So, this is going to be a bit shorter than normal, but I just can't really, I don't really know how to, else to hold off for another few minutes. So, in the next episode, I should have two matches because... Is there's only two, 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 uh, two days gap. Yep. So, uh, unless there's a lot of negotiating. So, hopefully, that won't be the case. Yes. In the next episode, you will see this. Gonna. Pug. Pag. Game. Um, when I hope to reopen the gap. Yep. Ah. Heck, to 15 points. And you'll also see the quarterfinal, and I'm sure it's the quarterfinal this time, against Stad Renens. So, oh, I've already done my outro. Oh, so all that's left to say is, until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace.